welcome to another video uh, this is kind of a mini episode because uh, I haven't done anything new I'm still the paddles but there's a change you may notice that the blue the left paddle the right it's on our left now is much smaller than the red one and it's much smaller than it used to be because it's a different counter it's piston based instead of redstone based and other than the fact that it's smaller and looks better and uses pistons which makes it cooler uh, it's a bit faster now I've set up a demonstration where these up and down switches apply to both the red and the blue paddles so you may see that it's, it looks like it's the same speed uh, it doesn't you may not uh, here you can see it's not only faster but it's better you may have noticed that the uh, the left paddle went up and then down we can do it again by pressing up you will you will see it kind of flickers and that's because it's not synchronous synchronous uh, which means that because it uses bits and because of the ripple effect on the counters uh, some bits change faster or slower than others and the piston is not bit based it's not binary based which means that that problem doesn't apply uh, so it's a bit faster it's smaller smaller it uses pistons and it's uh, synchronized so here you can see the counter which is basically a rotate, rotating memory you may have seen this on other videos but I'm using it as a counter when I press the up button it turns counterclockwise sending the wool up this is the lowest uh, position this is the highest and when I press down the counterclockwise pistons activate it's not very complicated and it works much better so after posting this video the red uh, paddle will also uh, change to this design and that's all I have to show you right now over there in the distance you can see I'm working on another counter two of them actually for the balls I'm trying to make it synchronized again, again. So far, I'm having moderate success. So that's it uh, so far.